At our January 23rd council meeting, one of the first items on the agenda was a proposal to readjust the urban boundary of the city to allow for an expansion here in the St. Lawrence Business Park in the East End. Now there are a number of businesses that are interested in locating here in Kingston. The biggest challenge is the lack of industrial land to be able to accommodate them. So last night, Council voted unanimously to approve a new plan that would see a readjustment of the boundary to bring in 60 more acres of land here in the business park. Now, the proposal was put together in consultation with representatives from the Indigenous Food Sovereignty Garden to make sure that as the industrial land is redeveloped, that it can be done so in a more environmentally friendly way with ecological corridors, more biodiversity and green spaces. And finally, last night, Council had an extended discussion about whether or not to change the city's current greenhouse gas emissions target from a 30% reduction by 2030 to a 50% reduction. Now, there were a number of councillors around the table that expressed support for the more ambitious goal in general, but also a number that expressed concerns about needing more information. For example, what the costs would be if we were to take a more accelerated move towards electrification as well as information about external barriers beyond the city's control, such as whether or not the sufficient supply of electricity to accommodate that move. In the end, Council voted unanimously to wait for that information before making any change to the city's target. And that information is expected to come back to Council in 2025.